Hi, this is Marisha. You on my channel Triloka. I'm doing some of the normal readings for the mid month. Uh, this reading is for the sign of Scorpio. Um, I'm using two decks. Uh, one is the Under the Roses Lenormand, and the other one is the Enchanted Lenormand Oracle deck. Okay. Uh, I have already pulled a few cards on our clarifiers. Um, the five cards which I've initially pulled is the man card, uh, the moon, letter, sight, which is a sickle, um, and the ring. Okay. So off the bat, I'm, uh, I'm seeing um, a man is planning to commit to somebody else, but before that, he's planning to uh, cut off a relationship okay he is planning to get separated uh, with the letter the ring and the sight in between I want to say um, some kind of divorce is happening on the paper okay mm, the moon and the sickle is uh, mirroring each other so um, a status is being uh, um, severed okay so if uh, the lady is a missus, okay? That status is going to be a miss after the severance, okay? After she gets divorced, uh, she becomes a miss, okay? So some kind of uh, status is going to be severed, okay? On paper, like, um, yeah, on paper, because the center card is the letter. And um, what else? I want to say the man is initiating this, okay? Yeah. Also, I want to say the reason behind the severance is because uh, he has found a new person, okay? Uh, because the letter is um, the letter card. Just a moment. The letter card is clarified with the man, the bear, the snake, and the lady, okay? So in this what I see is uh, between this man and the lady there is the snake, okay? Snake situation which is the bear. So um, whoever he is cutting the ties with he is planning to commit to a new woman, okay? So, uh, the ex might be the mother of his child as well with the bear card there. And she is the snake in this situation, okay? Hmm. Okay. And it's not going to be easy, okay? Um, that lady is not going to make it easy because we have the boom, okay, behind the deck. Is the boom or the whip okay so she's not going to take it easy okay uh, yeah so this divorce situation whatever it is it's not going to be uh, easy okay because she is not happy okay With the, uh, with the ring, okay, the man is mirroring the ring, okay, man plans to commit, okay, it's coming like this, so, yeah, the man is facing the ring, okay, so he plans to commit after he has severed the relationship with his uh, ex, okay, with the current uh, person, and he plans to move on with the new person, okay, he plans to um, propose maybe, uh, the ring is clarified with a bouquet, but there is a mountain and a heart, okay? So, uh, there's lots of uh, hurdles, okay, for him to commit or him to propose to this woman or put a ring on, his, on her finger or make it official on paper, 
He has to first sever the first relationship. That's what I see with some of you people. I'm reading for the sign of Scorpio. Um, yeah. So for him to make it official, uh, there's lots of challenges, okay? Yeah. I think he's stuck. I can see he's stuck, okay? Because he cannot do anything about it. What else? Sickle. Sickle is related to a lady, okay? Lady, and uh, as I said before, um, it might be the mother, okay? Because I get the lady and the frog. So I feel um, if he has to move on to a new commitment, he has to uh, sever, okay? Sever uh, the first relationship, okay? And I feel this man has a child, okay? Um, the lady he's um, getting the divorce from has born his child, okay? Um, she's a mother of his child, okay? And uh, I get up uh, because with the clouds and the um, um, tree, okay? This man is yet unsure or the woman is yet unsure what will happen to this relationship okay to this whole situation after the divorce papers are signed okay that's why uh, um, the lady is making it difficult for the uh, man to proceed with the divorce papers okay because maybe she is not uh, willing to let go she's not willing to let go maybe on behalf of her child um, yeah, behalf of her stability, okay, with the key in the house, okay, with her, she's not, uh, she's unsure what will be her situation once he walks out, okay, uh, like completely out of her life, then um, she's unsure. The man has uh, clarified with the fishes, okay, as I was, uh, as I was saying, um, he might be having children, okay, um, whom he is walking away from because the path has come. And um, um, there is a seer, okay, the seer lady, and there is the anchor, okay. So I want to say um, the path he is taking, it might be right, okay, even though he is uh, cutting off uh, his um, other life, okay, his uh, uh, relationship. It might be designed, okay? It might be on the cards. Uh, um, wherever he is going, okay? Because you see the man walking away. Okay, wherever he is going, it is designed, okay? Uh, it is in the cards for him to move, move away and uh, uh, offer this commitment, okay? So he is on the right path. But it's not going to be an easy journey for you, okay? Okay, this is for a man. If you're the cause for you, this is for you. What else? Mm. This could be for the man in the labyrinth life, okay? Or you're the labyrinth man whom I'm speaking to. What else? The moon. Uh, the moon in between the man and the letter, it is making it official, okay? Uh, the moon is uh, clarified by uh, the dog, the stars, and the sun, and the lily. I want to say at this point, um, you need to make keep it cordial, okay? Uh, because the moon and the sickle was uh, marrying each other. And uh, sickle, I was speaking about the woman was unsure about her uh, state of affairs after the man, uh, after they both signed on the uh, divorce papers, okay, or uh, the divorce proceedings is completely, she's unsure of her situation after that. So with the moon card, mm, the advice I'm, uh, I want to give here is you have to be cordial with the woman, okay, with your past. After all, she might be the 
uh, mother of your child as well. Um, so you need to be friendly, on friendly terms with her and not just chop her out of your life just like that and disregard her. Okay, at least. Um, give her that uh, that uh, you know she she has been with you in a phase of your life so you need to consider that and give her that much credit okay that's the word I was looking for you need to give her credit for the part she had uh, you know she had played in your life probably she might have been a friend to you a mother to your child or just a wife okay or, or a girlfriend okay if you plan to split with her okay it's good enough but don't just disregard the bond which you had between the two of you okay uh, you need to be on speaking terms with her okay the dog and the uh, stars so you need to still speak with this lady okay that is your advice card with the sun and the lady you need to keep the harmony between you two okay is there anything else did i miss out on something yeah so there is something new uh new um beginning in your horizon but then you will have to sort out the this mess okay the advice here would be okay since you're dealing with the whip or the broom the advice here is if you're dealing with a divorce situation in your life okay um, and you feel you're stuck in your life uh, be cordial to this lady okay if she is the mother of your child assure her that uh, it is not working but then even if you get divorced and you get committed to another person in your life you're still going to look after her as a friend okay now i'm going to completely eliminate her from your life you need to assure make that assurance to her then only anything is going to uh, you know proceed for you okay is that uh, i'll just pull since it's only 12 minutes i'll just pull another spread three cards maybe Anything else for the scorpion paper? Anything else for the scorpion paper? Scorpion people, men, 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 men. You have got a scatork. Got the stork, the snake, and the lady. Okay. I'm not sure all three of the same person. Okay. I'll just pass pass. and the key it came out earlier as well i was on the key together and it was a jumper earlier so and again stork is uh, clarified with the crossroads as well as the woman okay the snake is a new woman because the ring is there oh my god Again, the snake. Oh my god. Okay. Scorpion people. Watch out. Oh my god, please. Stork again. Oh my god, what's going on? What about the lady? This is crazy. I wish I can show you the. 
Oh, cards as well. I need to figure out my second breast. Look at the lady. What about the lady now? <laughs> ship. Oh my god, this is a treat, okay? Because the outcome earlier was ship and here the ship, okay? I know what this is about already, but let's see. Because all the cards have repeated itself. So this is a solid message for you scorpions out there. Fighter. Mama card, please. Man, okay. So. This, it's a gas, this lady, a snake in the stork is looking at the man, okay? It is pointing because I broke the deck to see what it is about and they are all looking at this man. Okay. So with the stork, um, so stork, snake and the lady, okay? Three cards, okay? So I wanted to see uh, and it is looking at the man, okay? Because I broke the deck to see what this was all about. Um, uh, ship was there behind the deck, but I broke the deck to see uh, what it was, and there came the man. So all the three, three people, uh, three uh, subjects are looking at this man. Okay. So stork to me is a woman uh, who's pregnant as well, like a mother. Okay. Uh, or a new beginning. Okay. Uh, new something, a transformation. But for now, I was looking at it as the. Um, lady okay in this man's life okay i want to see whether this is all one lady or there are two ladies okay this is the continuation of the earlier message so there is this fair warning to the person okay to this guy who's planning to split up with his lady with his current partner to be with a new woman so um with the stork okay the change which you are uh the change which is which you are taking okay um you're walking towards a lady okay with the store card okay and tower i so want to say this is some kind of a warning for you guys okay like i've been trying to make you aware of a decision which you're taking which might be not as it seems like you know you don't know the whole clear picture because with the snake in the center and um, it clarified for me with the ring the snake and the clover okay flowers may I say this is the new, snake is a new woman in your life in the earlier reading if you see um uh, I don't know, uh, I think it was a site or something, um, or the letter, uh, between the man and the woman, if you, uh, if you just check back uh, the reading which I uh, just did, uh, between the man and the woman was the, um, uh, the snake as well as there was something, okay. And I was saying now uh, she's not going to make it easy for you because there is a, a second woman between you people. Okay, so with the ring. So what I want to say is uh, the snake up here, the person whom you're planning to commit to, okay, uh, you need to um, check her out, okay, because she is turning up as a snake and she's turning, when I clarify those two cards, uh, she's gaining something, okay. With the flower there, she might be looking for money, maybe. Okay, something she's gaining something out of this. What is it? Okay, from this man, she's gaining something out of it. Go, garden. Okay, she's looking out for a suitor. Okay, and she finds you suitable, and maybe she is the person who comes in between you people. Okay, earlier I was saying. Um, the snake is your wife or the mother to your child or something but now I want to correct that and say the snake is your the second lady who has come into your life okay and she wants to break it between 
you and your wife, okay, for her own benefit. Wow, I didn't see the stress. Okay. Yeah, see the fox, okay. She has an ulterior motive behind breaking you guys up, okay. So if you're planning to propose to this woman and waiting for things to end up with your uh, earlier person, okay, earlier um, uh, relationship, then you need to watch out uh, for the person whom you're planning to commit to because that person is not having a uh, clear, clean uh, slate, okay? That person's agenda is questionable right now. One okay? See later. I remember this was um, the center card in the previous reading and for that was the clarifiers which I put which I uh, came out as a lady and the man and in between there was a snake and now I'm looking at the snake and trying to clarify what she is about. This one, yeah. I just, just, I'm shedding light to you in a situation which you need to look at okay okay don't get blinded by the situation just look at it from all the angles even evaluate the new lady in your life okay because she's chopping your relationship she's severing the current relationship for her own motives okay so there and this yeah i get the clair um the clairvoyant card and the uh, birds and the bear and the bear with the sun so i might be the person who is giving you this message okay because with this air uh, i i might be opening your eye to what the actual situation is by communicating with this message okay uh, with your situation with the lady okay with the mother okay she might be um, Put in the spot, okay? You, uh, I want to say with this moon card, you might be not seeing things as it is, okay? Um, um, you might be uh, in an illusion right now, okay? Um, having illusions right now about your current relationship with this new lady. You need to uh, analyze her because there is something going on with this new person, okay? um and about the lady okay so this might be uh your previous partner okay your ex or going to be ex or you're planning to make her the ex okay whom you're moving away from uh, the man is moving away from your message okay there is a rider coming in and what is that what is the message for this man anchor coffin one I get a coffin, anchor, and the tree. Okay, this is fair. Okay, this this might be the first time I'm going to go about a reading like this. I'm going to combine both the readings now and summarize it for you. If you are the man, okay. If you are the scorpion person or you're the cross watcher okay who is listening to this um reading if you're planning to severe the tie with your wife the mother of your child or your girlfriend for a new person to come in okay to commit to a new person i would say analyze this new person because their motives are not um, in the right space, okay? Uh, yeah. I would also say, if you're planning to go ahead with the divorce, okay? Uh, divorce situation. Procrastinate. That's your advice here. Delay it, okay? Delay it. Don't come to a finality regards to the situation you don't have to tell your new girlfriend about it okay uh, take the time to analyze it 
okay analyze your situation okay because the earlier i told you are a woman but don't cut ties with your woman because that was the advice which i i was telling you earlier uh, because she will be uh, she will feel like she's lost and there was a bit card earlier like the broom card uh, like it is being delayed and she is not happy about it and uh, because she doesn't know what she will do after you have severed ties with her okay and i was advising you not to cut ties with her just like that and leave her you know on the road okay don't do that now i am advising you if you're planning to sever this uh, relationship with your wife don't move away yet okay if you don't want to live with that person it's fine okay but give it time okay give it time with your new person okay analyze her you don't want to be in a situation where you made a mistake and then you can't go back to your previous person okay to your ex-wife or whatever it is uh, so don't cut it off like blunt cut but you can't repair it anymore that is my advice for you okay because the new person in your life is a fucking snake okay i'm sorry about this but um yeah they give you two readings to give you this message okay so whoever this is for watch out okay scorpions scorpions i will um uh, i'll give you an advice card as well 26 minutes Full completion. This is your card. Okay, the person is like um, standing on thin ice. Okay, he doesn't know if the next step he takes, he is going to fall into the pond, the ice water. Okay, and suffocate and die. But nobody wants to be in that situation. Okay, mm, so it speaks about uncertainty doubt and hesitation loss of faith unstable conditions be extra cautious just got be extra cautious okay this is the message for the people i read earlier okay be extra cautious you might not be seeing the situation as it is because people are just putting uh, what do you say like wool over your eyes okay you can't see through it okay see through their mask okay there is a discord in the relationships okay there is a discord you might be uh, separating trying to separate yourself from somebody okay there is so much confusion going on okay it is unstable right now uh there's so much doubts and hesitations there is loss of faith okay you don't have any faith in whatever is going on around you okay there is so much uncertainty okay and i had to look behind the deck as well for some reason Although I was only planning on giving one advice card. Oppression. This is your state right now. Oppressed. Okay. I see so many crows, you know, crowing around you. Okay. If that's the word, crowing. 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 Okay. So it's, it's, you know, so many people are, you know, barking around you, like pushing you into a corner. Okay you might feel very restricted you might feel very depressed okay um you deplete your resources feeling cut off punished confined okay you feel very confined in your situation you cannot speak to anybody else because you feel like nobody is supporting you in this situation okay uh, you feel exhausted okay mm, yeah but um, what you can do is even if you're oppressed into one corner you have your own self, you have your body, you have your mind, you have your soul, okay? 
you just need yourself okay in the right state of mind to think process things analyze things that is all you need you don't need to listen to everybody around you to come to come to a conclusion you just need your whole being okay in one piece okay to think straight to analyze it okay with your heart with your mind with your soul what you feel is right is the right thing okay but you need to analyze it don't make things okay don't make the snake uh you know tell you things about somebody else okay and you make your decision as per what is being said to them no think with the light within you okay you are being guided okay if you listen to yourself you being guided to make decisions for your own self which is for your own well-being okay and not because somebody said you so okay yeah with the crows in there okay with the crows around this okay if you can actually see this so much is going around you so many people are telling you different stuff okay but you are there holding a light okay so you can see that you feel very you know discontented um, but then you are sitting in a corner with your own light and that is all you need okay when you are put when you are alone you are not actually alone because you have yourself and that is not being alone yeah yeah that would be it okay so i would say be very extra cautious about the person who was uh, i was talking to earlier about that would be it for now thank you so much this is marisha and you are on my channel to look until next time bye